Tesla. They are installing a Tesla, roof. A Tesla solar roof. Tesla <laughs> solar roof. We are in Columbus, Ohio today with our friends from Newman Roofing and uh, of course our good friends from Tesla as well. They are installing a Tesla roof right behind us and we're going to check this one out and see how this one's going. We're like the Tesla roof people now. Yeah. We just go around and find Tesla roofs being installed we're and hang Tesla out on them. We're Tesla family. <laughs> Got Tesla vehicles, Tesla solar power. I mean it's really interesting. It is I didn't interesting. know how much goes into it and it's so intricate. So I'm really excited to share all this. Let's check it out. Okay. Over here is where they actually have staged the material for this job and this is all the Tesla pallets that came from the Tesla factory. Let me show you guys something cool though. This is a conventional pipe jack, right? Like this is what you would potentially see installed on a roof. This is Tesla's version of the same thing. pretty stout and it's built by Tesla like it's literally got a Tesla marking on it and it's this is a Tesla manufactured product so everything down to even the pipe jacks for this roof are manufactured by Tesla and then we've got the actual Tesla panels here these are the solar panels so these are actually photovoltaic panels the tiles here are actually capturing electricity right now sitting here if you were to plug these in you would probably get shocked this is not stuff you want to mess around with Leave it to the experts. Yeah, leave this to the experts for sure. I am not licensed. So we're here with Alexis Newman. Hey. Good to see you, yeah. Good to see you guys. Newman Roofing, you guys are doing an amazing job on this roof. Yeah, it's a great candidate for the Tesla solar roof and so far so good. This has been really cool to see a Tesla solar roof going on in Columbus. This is probably one of the first ones in this area. Yep. Second one in the state of Ohio that we know wow. of. Second oh, one we've cool. installed and that's first so cool. one in this area. So That's wow. so cool. So how does the process look for someone to actually buy one of these roofs? Yeah, so it starts out with a screen phone call, just taking a look at the home, making sure it's a good candidate for it, making sure logistically it makes sense to invest this, um, invest in this project, make sure that the payoff makes sense to where you're making enough energy that it lasts and pays for itself in the 25 years that they want to get through. Pretty much an investment. It is, it's a 25 yeah. year investment. It's not something, the first thing I tell people is this is not a roof replacement. Right. This is a home right. remodeling project that's gonna pay it for itself over the next 25 years. It's not an in and out one day roof installation. This is a complete remodeling of your home. Yeah, right. it's, pretty, it's pretty intense, but the payback is pretty amazing though. Like these guys are gonna have you know, they got a power wall, so they're going to be able to get energy and store it and be able to utilize it at different times. It's pretty, it's pretty amazing. Absolutely. Looking at their energy and what they use every month and what this is going to produce, they're looking at complete offset. No kidding. Yep. Producing enough electricity to power their home. And then they have the power wall being installed so that they can get energy during the evenings and through the night as well. That's so awesome. since it's not a re-roof, it's technically a remodel, do they have to like tell their insurance companies and let them know that it now is a solar power roof? Yeah, so we always suggest reaching out to your home insurance to see if they need to change anything on the policy, but you can right. also possibly get money taken off of your home insurance because of the quality Tesla puts in their materials. Oh, wow. The ratings on it is much higher than asphalt shingles, so you're really protecting your home better, which could benefit your home insurance. That's cool. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it makes sense. And it's a class mm -hmm. three rated shingle, so it's impact resistant. Exactly. Yep. Yeah. And so you might actually get some asphalt shingles don't have that. So Yeah. Well, most don't. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. This is a really nice system. It looks great. Yeah. I think when you pull up to this home, it's going to be a completely different look on it and it's going to yeah. be, it's going to be breathtaking. I mean, yeah, it already is. I, so, when I'm trying to uh, describe this on the phone to someone, I say it's a mix of standing seam metal and slate look because it's got that glossy texture to it, but right. it also has the tiles that give that kind of slate definition. Yeah. It definitely gives us some character for sure. Mm -hmm. yeah, it looks totally different. It yeah. does. Yeah. So, so who is the ideal candidate to receive this type 
of Ruth? Because you said you, in the beginning, you know, you want to make sure it makes sense. Yeah. So who is ideally the ones that it will make sense for? So we look for homes that have roof structures that have those big open planes. So meaning like on this hip roof, she has four sides on every structure right. that we can get that those PV panels onto where she can produce a lot of electricity. Yeah. The more cut up the roof is with skylights, dormers, those kind of things, it diminishes that system size we can fit on there. Oh. So we want to make sure that we can get a big enough system size to offset those energy costs that they're facing right now. And we're in Columbus, Ohio, so what about winters here? Oh, yeah. So that's one of the biggest questions we get. Does solar make <laughs> sense in Ohio, yeah. right? We take that into consideration. We're looking at that energy offset. Um, we don't run that same kilowatt hour production rate that you might get out in California. We take into consideration where you're at in Ohio. Will you produce a less electricity on cloudy days? You will, but will you still produce electricity? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So right. um, you can account for that, and that's why you want that power wall too to help store the excess energy to get you through the evenings or maybe cloudier days where you're not producing as much. But it's still something where we take it into consideration, we run the numbers, and it still makes sense. So, yeah. Right. That's. I mean, that's got to be a big deal though. People are probably thinking that you know this isn't California or Florida. Yep. We're in. We're in Ohio. So. That and snow. Like what happens if snow gets on these? Yeah. Snow melts extremely quick because they are glass panels. They heat a lot quicker than asphalt does when right. that sun does come out after the snow. So this home compared to the other ones in the neighborhood, you're going to see the snow come off of it a lot quicker than the asphalt shingle ones. Makes sense. I like it. Looks great. Great yeah. job. It does. Thank you. It does. <laughs> Well, and like one thing about Newman, you guys are so put together too, though. Like the way you guys operate as a business, this is I like you're the ideal contractor to be doing a project like this. Absolutely. How I describe it to the homeowners when I'm talking to them is that we're really taking this project from start to finish. Yeah. So from the initial consultation, we are your connection with all the other components that are part of this project because you have electricians, you have Tesla yeah. design plans, yeah. you have permitting with the city, the county, you have the electricity company. So right. all of those are aspects that go into this project, which is really what classifies as a home remodeling project. Um, but we're spearheading it, we're taking it on, and it's really minimal for the homeowner. So right. we're doing all the permitting process, the interconnections, working with Tesla to get those design plans for you. And then once the install comes, it should be seamless after that point too. We come, we do our thing, our in-house electrician comes, gets you hooked up, we pass inspection, and then we even top it off at the end with our IT manager coming out and making sure that Tesla app is on your phone and you're seeing, yeah. seeing all the electricity you're producing now, so. Right. So if there's issues or anything, do they contact you or Tesla? So I would say both right now. Tesla mm -hmm. does have their warranty line that you can reach out to, but ultimately Newman, we take care of our customers and yeah. doing this makes it no different. You are our customer, so we're gonna be out here to make sure it's taken care of for you. That's cool. It's a lot of work for you guys. It is, but you guys have <laughs> that's the team how we treat every like project. You have your in-house <laughs> IT guy, you've got your permitting people, you've got great production managers. Like it's you guys are so well put together for a project like this that it makes it a no-brainer that you guys become the Tesla people in this area. Yeah, absolutely. Um, we're we're hands-on throughout the whole process, and our biggest thing, no matter if it's Tesla, if it's asphalt, if it's standing seam, is the customer experience. So we want to make right. sure that customer is 100% happy, aware of what's going on, what we're doing, and 100% satisfied at the end. Well, you guys picked a good week. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's beautiful. All right, we're back here, and this is actually day four of this build, and it's almost done. They've done a really great job. This, this roof looks amazing. Yeah, they're finishing up sooner than they estimated, and it's looking amazing. Gutters are being installed now as well, so it's this has been an exciting project. It's always awesome to see these roofs come together, and you know, for this homeowner, obviously for them, it was a really important thing that they lower their carbon footprint, and what better way to do it than by installing a, a Tesla solar roof? And so when you look at these projects, that's what you're looking at. What are you doing this for? Some people think, oh, this is just really expensive. Well, no, it's it's there's an offset there. You're you're helping the environment. You're doing stuff for for your your own use. You're gonna actually have your own energy. How cool is that? And then you got a company like Newman that can come out here and do a great job on it. So yeah. win-win. It's an investment. Yes. It is an investment. And I mean, what's smart of an investment on something that covers your home, yeah. your everyday life? And gives you energy. Yeah. How cool is that? It is so, cool. 